Hi, hey, I'm Morgan, and it is officially midnight of January 8, 2016, which means that the Winter Biennial Bibliothon is upon us. So I figured I would vlog my experience. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty excited to be doing this. I did some numbers crunching when looking at my TBR for this readathon and realized that in order to finish all of the books in these seven days, I have to read about 411-ish pages per day, which is a little like, oh goodness, but thankfully um, I have a book that is multimedia format, so that's the book I'm going to be starting with, and that is Illuminae by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. I feel like I'm just going to like fly through this. I just wanted to do a little check-in. I'm probably going to stay up until about two or three and do some editing stuff. I'm just going to go read some Illuminae. I'll let you know how that goes when I check in later today. <clears throat> Doing another little check-in. It is 8.45. I just woke up and I stayed up till about like 2 reading Illuminae. I think I read about a hundred something pages and started getting sleepy. I have the day off work so I think I'm just gonna spend a majority of it reading after I run some errands. So I'll check in later. Remember when I checked in at like 8.45 and said that I would be reading all day until I ran errands? Well, I fell back asleep and didn't wake up until about 11.30 and uh, read like 10 or so pages of Illuminae and now it's time for me to go run my errands. So hopefully I can find more time to read so that way I can meet my goal of 411 pages. I'm really enjoying this so far. Um, it's really interesting. I was worried about it being multimedia that I wouldn't be able to develop many like attachments to characters and to the plots and stuff. But I love the characters. I think Katie and Ezra are super awesome. I think Ezra might be my favorite character as of right now. But yeah, I gotta go run some errands and hopefully when I check back in later this evening I will have read more. I took a break from reading. I'm still reading Illuminae but I took a break to let you guys know that I just partook in my first reading sprint. It was a little 20 minute sprint that was hosted over on the Bybib, ch Bybib channel um, or Bybib Twitter account. It was about 20 minutes and I read 26 pages which is pretty exciting. I'm pretty close to hitting the page count but I plan on going further than that and I'm gonna check in around 11:45 ish for my night wrap up of day one okay so it's literally been like two minutes but I wanted to let you know that I lied I'm actually taking part in a one hour reading sprint starting in like two minutes so I will update you at the end of that sprint which will be around 11:50 ish just thought you should know <laughs> so this is gonna be my last check-in for day one of the biennial bibliothon uh, I just did an hour-long reading sprint where I read about 80 pages of Illuminae, and in total, just today, I've read 486 pages. I might change my book for the challenge uh, read of 2016 release to Gemina because I am really, really enjoying this. Winter, I'm not really a contemporary reads type of person, so I don't think I'll fly through the unexpected everything as much as I would in the summer. Depending on how Illuminate ends, I might go right into Gemina, but the plan is I'm going to finish Illuminate tonight and start Blind by Rachel DeWoskin, which is the shortest book on my TBR. But it's getting really crazy, so I'm going to uh, take a little break because I've been reading nonstop since like 8 p.m. and then doing sprints in between. So I'm going to take a little break and then finish this and probably go to bed or something. <laughs> but yeah, day one of Bionel Bibliothon was pretty successful. I did two reading sprints, that was my first time doing that. It was really intense and really cool and I really enjoyed it. And I read almost 500 pages, even after like running a buttload of errands. So I'm pretty happy about that. So yeah, I'll check back in tomorrow morning, probably when I'm having my morning coffee and reading. <laughs> okay, bye.
Good morning. It is a little after 9 o'clock a.m. on day two and I just woke up so I figured I would check in. Around 2.15 last night I finished Illuminae by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Around the time that I was about um, at my midway point it was looking like a four star read for me but by the time I finished it I was so overcome with so much emotion I couldn't not give this book five stars and I have a small little review over on my Goodreads but I think I'm gonna do a full video review and like discussion video and I will be the first book review on my channel but yeah I didn't read anything after that I went to sleep and I still haven't decided what I'm going to read yet today I can't I don't know if I'm gonna read blind or if I'm gonna hop into Gemina. I know Gemina wasn't on my TBR, but I might swap my 2016 release pick because I need to know what happens next in this series. I'm, I'm going crazy. But yeah, I'll keep you posted. I'll check back in in a few hours and let you know what I pick. I forgot to mention that I went over all my vlog footage from yesterday after I finished reading to look at what all I had done. And I realized that I had said 2016 and not 2017. It's, it's been a couple hours and I've actually gotten some reading done so I figured I would check in. It's about 11.45 of day two and I'm about 100, a little over 100 pages through Gemina. I picked Gemina for uh, my next book. Illuminate was just too good. I couldn't not continue but I am gonna take a little break from reading and pre-film some videos for upload on Tuesday Thursday so I might check back in after I get my filming done or after I get some reading done after that I haven't decided yet I, I don't work until Wednesday so I'm moving right along in this reading but I'm trying to get ahead because Wednesday Thursday I work like all day so yeah we'll see how I do I'll check back in later so I figured I'd do a little checking because I just finished up filming after watching booktube for an embarrassingly long time. But yeah, I filmed something Harry Potter-esque. It'll be up probably Tuesday. I'll... maybe. I don't know. I can't make any promises. It'll definitely be up before my vlog of the readathon goes on. But yeah, I think I'm gonna curl up and read some more now. So I'll check in when I've read more. <laughs> It's about 3.45 and I figured I'd do a check-in because I'm about to leave to go to the gym and won't be reading until I get back. I'm on about page 133 of Gemma because filming took a lot longer than I was expecting, but I should be at the gym for like a couple hours when I get back. I'm going to just be marathoning this book, so I'll check in um, later. <laughs> A wild Chandra has appeared for this check-in. Oh, hello! I have not read any more of Gemina since I last checked in, but I was just checking in to let you know that I'm about to read. So, I'll be back at like 11.50 for my final thoughts on day two. Nope, stay. <laughs> Come here! Come back. Sit. Or, well, you're already sitting, but stay. Stay. Shh, shh. No, come here. Come on, you just did it. Got it in the air. Oh, she's so good. Doge. <laughs> so it's <laughs> screw you. So it's my last check-in for day two. I'm on about page 205 of Gemina, and I need to be on page about 2.99 for my page count quota. But I mean, how can I like read when such a cutie is right here looking at me? Also, he's not bad, but. I have all day tomorrow to just power read, so I definitely plan on finishing this as well as starting 
I think Six of Crows tomorrow? I don't know. I haven't decided yet what I'm doing with my life. But yeah, that's my little wrap up for day two. I didn't read as much as day one, but today was hectic and my dog is super cute. So let's hope that day three is better. Hello, day three. I just woke up. Um, this plates my voice. My voice like this every time I wake up. I haven't read anything yet today. I stayed up until about um, 12.30 reading. I read about 50 pages. Uh, John had to be up at like 8, so I didn't stay up as late as I normally do reading. Um, but I figured I'd let you know what I'm doing. I don't have work today. And yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and read all day. I'm probably gonna finish Gemini on page 246 of Gemini. So I had to be on page 299 by last night and I obviously didn't get there, but I'll get there and then I'll finish the book and start Six of Crows. Look at this! We have another guest with us today. I've been running around for the past like two days and I just feel like cooping myself up and reading. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'll check in here in a couple hours, I think. Look at this little man joining me for the vlog all week. So it's about 12.30 and I'm on page 309 of Gemini. I'm taking a little break to eat some lunch and edit vlog footage from yesterday, but that probably won't take very long. Um, I'm pretty much right on track to be at my goal for the day. I have to finish this as well as read 51 pages of whatever book I read next, but I'll check in here in a couple hours once I've gotten more reading done. I just want to stay on track with my editing and I also have to upload today's video, so I'm going to do a little editing party. <laughs> Editing took a lot longer than I was expecting, and my video is just now going up. I read maybe two pages while my video was exporting, but now, now is where I will read until John gets home from work, and then we're gonna eat pizza and watch Gilmore Girls, and then I'm probably gonna read some more. It's not really going how I'm wanting it to go, but we're doing okay. My Harry Potter tag video just went up on YouTube. I'm gonna freaking read this book. Gang's all here, am I right, ladies? Have anything to say, John? My dog's pretty awesome. <laughs> Your hair looks astounding. So it's 11.40 and I'm doing my last check-in kinda early cause John has never seen Blackfish. So we're gonna watch Blackfish and get real sad and maybe take down SeaWorld. Sad? I thought it was just about a fish that happens to be black. <laughs> yeah, it's a lovely story about whales. Oh. But um... Oh whale. <laughs> I am on page 454 of Gemini. John said this earlier, if I had started this like with the little gap in between after finishing Illuminae, I may have enjoyed it more, but I needed more content because I just assumed this was going to have more Katie and Ezra in it. And spoiler alert, it doesn't, even though that's not a spoiler. It's in the synopsis. Right now, this is looking like a 3.5, 4 star read for me. I like it, but I don't like it as much as I loved Illuminae. Now, John and I are going to eat chips and salsa and watch Blackfish. Yay, Blackfish! <laughs> so, I'll check in tomorrow morning. That was my... Day three? Day three of the Biomobiliathon wrapped up. It was decent. <laughs> okay, bye.